Hey guys, what's going on? Cody from Mad Vapes Easily here, and I got a new tank for you that uh, just came out most recently from uh, Aspire. It is the Nautilus 2 tank. So this is the, uh, it's actually really not the Nautilus 2 because you had the original Nautilus, you had the Nautilus Mini, you had the Nautilus X, but this is what they're calling the Nautilus 2, um, and it is top fill. It says precise adjustable airflow, compact yet curvy design, and a 2 mil capacity, um, which is TPD compliant, which I'm not exactly 100% on what that is. Um, and it also says improved flavor production. Um, they sell this in a couple different colors. They've got stainless steel, anodized black, anodized red, anodized blue, anodized silver, and anodized gray. Um, I'm pretty sure that we have the uh, anodized silver one here today. Or this actually is stainless steel from what it looks like. But um, enough about that. We'll break into what comes in the box here. So if you open this up, you'll get this little insert where you can just pull this out. And down in there is your manual, and that's got all the different colors on it. Yeah, we definitely got the stainless steel one. Um, your warranty card. And that looks like that's about it. Um, in this little insert right here, you've got another mouthpiece, which is a uh, stainless steel mouthpiece that looks very similar to this one. I don't really see a difference in them. Let's take a look at it real fast. Yeah, it's pretty much the same thing. Yeah, same thing. So I guess that's just in case you lose it or anything like that. At least they give you a spare one. Um, you've also got a coil in here. Um, they seem to still use the original Nautilus coils from what it looks like. Um, or, I mean, they at least look the same. When I ordered them um, along with the tanks, it acted like they were different, but it seems like it's still the BVC coils. Um, so they're 4.2 to 5 volts, or if you're looking at wattage, they're 10 to 14 uh, watts. So they're a 1.8 ohm coil. And then you've also got your little... Uh, your little o-rings and stuff and your spare glass but I'm not gonna pull that out um, so to get this tank off you just unscrew this base piece down here and that'll pull that off it's got this little uh, this metal definitely protects that glass from getting busted or anything and then for some reason you can pull the uh, airflow adjuster ring off which is kinda weird but alright and then you've also got your uh, your coil right here so you can just pull that glass off pull out your coil and pop your new one in and the one that comes in the in the actual tank is also oh no it's a 0 .7 so it's 18 to 23 watts. Um, so definitely uh, for somebody that wants to experiment with a little bit higher wattage than just the regular um, under 16 watts, that's definitely the way the way to go with the uh, coil that they have in there. Um, Overall, I like Aspire, and I like the Nautilus tanks. They're definitely good for mouth-to-lung. Um, I wouldn't really say that they're a direct-to-lung tank at all. Um, if you're an experienced vapor or someone that prefers um, something where you're actually getting a huge amount of clouds and a really wide pull on it, this is definitely not a tank for you. Um, but... That being said, if you are somebody that blows a lot of clouds and likes the cloud chasing and stuff, this could be a tank for you for the specific fact that not everywhere you go you can just be blowing clouds all the time. So that really kind of kind of puts in perspective like, you know, you can't go into Walmart and just blow a huge cloud, but if you want to vape in there and be kind of, not, not that I'm condoning this, um, but if you wanted to vape in there, this would be a good tank for you to carry on some kind of smaller device where you could just hit it and, you know, there's no production, you're not really bothering anybody. But um, besides that, this is really intended for people that are first starting out, stuff like that, or somebody that just likes that really low wattage vape. Um, that's really all I've got on this device, or, well, this tank. If you have any questions about it, feel free to leave them in the comments below, and we'll be sure to get back to you, all right? Y'all have a great day.